So the Porsche 911 Speed Champions 6 wide conversion. The idea here was we're going to convert this 6 wide Speed Champions into an 8 wide set. Uh, the basic concept is to try and maintain as much of the overall aesthetic as, as, as possible. Uh, for example, the bumpers are very simple to to you know kind of update that to uh, to an eight wide, and this wing you know it's going to be very simple to upgrade this to a, to an eight wide. Uh, we're going to change the the window obviously from you know from four wide to six wide, so that'll give it a bit of a different characteristic. And I'm going to take the wheels uh, back in. Uh, I don't really like these uh, wheels. I think it makes it too much of a, of a caricature of a Porsche Turbo. But we'll try and maintain the rest. Uh, these curved lines and so forth, we'll try and re re maintain that. And I think that'll be relatively easy to to uh, to upgrade. Uh, the lights, unfortunately, will be kind of small, but I think they'll be okay when we get to that point. And I'm going to try and keep this line through here uh, into a smoother line um, and a bit more curved. So we'll try and do that. So let's get into a bit of deconstruction and gather up the parts that we're going to need to, to start building. So before we get too far, I thought I'd just show you a little bit of the progress that we start to make. So this is the, the bumper unit as an eight wide can see what a big difference it will make and here we've just reconstructed this uh, back bumper and we can utilize kind of all the all the parts uh, again but just a kind of a simplification uh, of the process of making it wider and uh, and here I've got uh, I've got the slopes already but I've got to harvest uh, some parts out of the out of the model uh, to do that and we've got the got our windscreen already so uh so let's get on with uh, the next stage so we're a bit further along the path i've got uh, the eight wide bumper i'm going to put this structure underneath it to get the right shape uh, so those go together uh, i've extended the bumper to six wide and this is the structure that's going to go above it giving this same uh, three lines and I've extended the the wing to, uh, to eight wide and we've freed out quite a lot of parts I've made a bit of an interior already uh, with two seats and this is going to become a, uh, a back seat and obviously the gear stick in there as well and so that that'll become the base of uh, this will become the base of the car as we get building so just get thought I'd give you a quick update kind of halfway through the building process. Uh, for me, the interior is really important that we get a good interior. So I've, I've started with that base. I've got the seats there, got a back seat in. The Porsches uh, have a little uh, back seat in there. I've got the, I think the length right. Uh, so we've got that, uh, got that little bit of extra length and we've got the, the back and uh, constructions going on. So that'll be the, the wing and, and the front bumper. And then of course the, the windscreen. So I'll start, uh, start a little bit to keep going and see where we get to. So we've got a bit more progress. Uh, I've now got this back bumper uh, section on and starting to, to take uh, the right sort of shape. Got more of a curve in, uh, curve in here, and uh, this flow, uh, flow effect. Unfortunately, I can't because I need these bits to stick together. Um, I I can't put a curve in there, but we're we're starting to starting to get there, and uh, we'll start making some some further progress uh, on the on the front uh, as we go. And I might finish off the, this back end uh, first. So we've got the uh, the well tail on, and uh, just to make sure that we're okay for for the roof, let's put that on. 
Um, please forgive this funny uh, stickers here. Uh, just cut up some sticker uh, that I had to fit on there, and the windscreen will fit in. Uh, will fit in like that. So uh, I think that's going to be okay for the height. Wise, uh, we'll get the windscreen just sits down one one uh, plate, and that should give us the right the right height. You can see here, you know, it's pretty clear. We've added in two two studs, and we've just added the, in one length, one stud uh, length so far, and I think that should be should be okay. So let's carry on. So this is the the front end design. Pretty simple. I've just added in uh, two slopes here, uh, and a couple of um, one by two tiles to to get the extra width. We've, as I showed before, I've added in here a, a one by two, and I've changed this totally, the spoiler design. Uh, and it's all very simply attached, just with some studs on the sides, and a little bit more solid construction to put it in place. And that whole thing can just fit nicely on the, uh, on the base. So we've got Effectively, the the whole length of the Porsche now in place, and we can just finish off the interior here. I'm going to take the roof off to do that, and the spoiler. Um, so we'll take that off, and I'll finish this off here and put on the put in the windscreen. So we've completed the the interior. Added in the windscreen, as I said, it's recessed, uh, recessed down one, one tile. Um, only a matter of putting on the wheels. And uh, as I mentioned before, I uh, I didn't want the wheels sticking out uh, too much, so I've changed the the wheels from the these large fourteen grey with um, 12 mil uh, tires on it to uh, to the 12 mil standard ones. And uh, there we have it, the eight white Porsche 911. Let me know what you think. I hope you enjoyed the the process of building the the Porsche 911 from a six wide to an eight wide. I'm really happy with the the outcome. Looks really good. Uh, it's even a good comparison to to the big Porsche. If I just do a straight comparison, I think it's come out pretty well. So uh, I hope you liked the video. Give me a like, and obviously, if you want to see more of this type of video, uh, subscribe. Till next time.